This is the Dancing with the Stars season premiere coming to you live. And homegrown superstar Tina Arena is a six time ARIA winner who has sold an incredible eight million records worldwide. She starred on the West End. She is a national treasure in France, but we're very lucky to call her her own. And stepping into the spotlight tonight, it is the one and only Tina Arena. Tina Arena, and I'm proud to say that I've sung in front of thousands, if not millions, of people over the last few years. But dancing in front of a couple of million viewers once a week is a whole new ball game, and I've got to say that it scares the living daylights out of me. Hello. 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 How are you? How are you? What have I got myself into? Oh. <laughs> <gasps> Contemporary. Contemporary. I'm sure there's not another one in there. <laughs> Three, four. Contemporary one. dance is very, very broad. It could be really great or scary. <laughs> We have bounce. Yeah, we're about three weeks behind because uh, of the busy schedule of Tina. So we've had to throw everything into our rehearsal period. So there's got to be no holding back. I think you're always nervous about lifts if you're not a professional dancer. You're probably worried about lifts as a professional dancer as well. I think she's been dropped before, so she's a bit worried if I do drop her. I've got to trust you, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> the body's basically in shock the first few weeks of dancing at this rhythm. One, two. I will be incredibly nervous before the first routine. Got it? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Dancing contemporary, Tina Arena and her partner Damien Whitewood. Just beautiful Tina Arena and in the very capable hands of Damien. Oh, oh, I'll give you that sparkly one. Sorry. The <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing? Fine. I'm glad that's over. <laughs> I was going to say, for someone who has had such a, an incredible career in the entertainment industry, again this afternoon in rehearsals, you were quite nervous, weren't you? Yeah, it's been a long day. Yeah. And I just didn't want to disappoint. <laughs> That's all. Are you surprised at the amount of work that it takes to, to get at the performance level no. here? Not in the least bit surprised. What you have to do in a few weeks is a lifetime of somebody's perfecting of their craft, which is virtually an impossibility. That's what these guys are doing, absolutely. I have enormous respect for this craft. You've got a little bit of snow in your Thanks, hair too. We got, there we go, just exactly. a little Thanks, dancing honey. snow out of there. Um, hey, is it lovely to be back in Australia? I love being home, yes. Yeah, we love having you home. Uh, did anyone see Tina sing the, the national anthem on the footy the other day? 
just <laughs> spectacular at the grand final. Have you been welcomed home warmly? I've always been welcomed home with open arms, so yeah. I'm a pretty lucky girl. Um, and, and is it true that you're staying with your mum and dad? I am. Hi, mum. Hi, oh, dad. Bad <laughs> Sorry topic. you couldn't come tonight. Next week. <laughs> is it true that you didn't, want, <laughs> yeah. they didn't want family in, so there's no yeah. more pressure? I saw, yeah, I said, no one come in. You can't come on my first week, please. I need to just survive it. Well, so I, think, <laughs> I think you did more than survive it. Absolutely. Now, I don't know how you fit it in also, because you've got, if I'm right, a, a new single, a new album, Mm -hmm. Soon to be released autobiography and something about a tour and motherhood yeah. and travelling. So how's training been for you guys? It's been tired, but she's yeah. coped really well. You know, when, when she's there, she's committed and that's all I can ask for. Would you like to win? <laughs> I'm just happy to get through. Yes. I yeah, <laughs> talk to him. Who would like He's Tina to win? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Good, good, good. Well, I was going to ask you that again next week. Uh, I'm going to ask you both to stay right here because uh, we're going to hear from the judges' scores after the break. Uh, of course, Tina's scores will complete our first leaderboard of the series, which stars shone the brightest. And who needs to apply a little bit more polish? We're going to find out next on Dance with the Stars.